Okay, guys, so yesterday I posted a video of Corey supposedly going to jail on Instagram Live. In that video, I did state that I believe it was all cap. Well, Corey went on Instagram Live again to explain exactly what happened. I gotta tell y'all something, man. I'm a YouTuber, right? I told y'all one time, I am a marketing genius. And I, I just want my respect, bro. I want my respect from a lot of people because a lot of y'all really think I went to jail and it's so hilarious to me. I've been laughing my ass up for the last, for the last down uh, I don't care. I've been laughing so hard. People tagging me. Everybody hit me up since I've been in a rich free court. I'm just sitting here just looking like, bro, I'm at home in my bed laughing my ass off. These folks think I went to jail. I'm a YouTuber, bro. I'm a marketing king, so I was vlogging the whole time. I was on the live video. When I was on live, everybody know I was vlogging the whole thing. Nah, no lie. I was really trying to get pulled up by police. I, I couldn't find a police. I mean, I didn't see a police, so I was trying to get pulled up by police. But see, I was on live, you know. The funny thing about it, I never even said I went to jail. That's the funny thing about it. Everybody just started posting free core. I know talk about what the hell i'm not in jail you feel me so i'm like hold on so i said you know what we're gonna run with it we're gonna run with it because i know for a fact my my video go do numbers so i haven't dropped the video yet but the video is gonna be crazy as hell so i let everybody just say free quarry i said me make me a more shot real quick you know what i'm saying create him a little more shot you know so when i drop my vlog it's gonna do numbers it's gonna it will do numbers. I'm trying to tell y'all like. Now, Corey also posted on his channel that he will be doing a full-on confession on the Carmen and Corey channel where he's going to speak on all of the alleged cheating. I ask myself a lot. I'd be like, why is this girl steady staying with me after what I put her through? I was that person. So he says, Corey cheated. It took a lot for me to do this. I'm not proud of my decisions I've made in the past, but I'm ready to let the truth off my chest and move forward happily with my wife after I feel like God has touched me and made me a better man. And he lets everyone know that it will be dropping today on the Carmen and Corey YouTube channel. Now, I don't know how I feel about this, only because this is going to make Carmen look really bad yet again. I mean, she already stuck through it once. Everyone was calling her crazy for staying with Corey after he cheated so many times. I mean, it was a personal decision that she made to stay, but I still see a lot of people bashing her for staying with Corey after he took her through so much. That's just my opinion on the whole situation. Now let's get on to the next topic with this Armand and Trey and Melly video. Now, a lot of people were speaking on the concept of of the video now in the video you can see they're dressed as slaves but they have on chains and this guy kev on stage did a reaction on tiktok and he says slavery is not a creative choice for a music so you get it video usually the slavery whips but now we call cars whips and then chains turn to diamonds comments had to say they said the most insulting part is that people will support this i truly hate it here this is just embarrassing imagine bleeding and dying just for your descendants to act like this i don't know one self-respecting black person that would do this now i did see this video about three weeks ago when it dropped but i did not read any of the comments but as I was watching the video, I did think it was kind of weird, the whole concept of the slavery and then them dancing. I just kind of didn't get why they chose that concept for their music video. On the statement that 100K, their management released, he said that we are living in modern day slavery. And that's why the guy Kev on stage said, you know, whips turned into car whips and chains turned into like diamond chains but i definitely want to know what you guys think about this down in the comment section below do you think that the video was totally uncalled for and that they should not have used that concept in a video and they kind of set black people back let me know what you guys think down in the comment section below now i also want to speak briefly on ty and daisha from the taylor girls because they did something really sweet for their mother and they posted it on their Instagram. Uh, leave. <laughs> you don't need those anymore. <laughs> really? What, what's going on? What's going on? What's going on? I want to tell you. Just look back at the blue. I want to tell you. 
that we're retiring you. You've worked this job for 16 years with no complaint. And you've put everyone's dreams and everyone before yours. You held it down for the family. You made sure everyone was where they wanted to be in life and you forgot about yourself. I just wanted to let you know that it's your turn now. It's your turn now. I do not want you working a job anymore. I want you to live your life do what and you go do, wake up after every dream that you've ever wanted to do but couldn't do it because you had kids. And a job and school. Yes. And I just want to tell you I love you. And here's a retirement gift. No, that's a no, 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 no. It's not a retirement gift. It's a it's an early advance. A early advance? Yeah, because you're quitting early, so you're not gonna get your retirement check. So it's just a little start, and then you'll still get paid, which you were already getting paid every two weeks. What? Yeah. Really? Yep. I can't, I don't know what to say. I don't know what to say. You have to make me cry for real. Please, just go ahead and cry. <laughs> I have a tissue. How do I my face with money, Ty? I cannot believe that this thing came so soon. Okay, open the bag. <sighs> Now that was super duper sweet. I know a lot of us dream of doing something like that for our families one day. So as always, I want to know what you guys feel about everything in this video. Let me know down in the comment section below.